Hey guys, it's me, Drew, and welcome back to my channel. As you see from the title above, this is going to be a July Scentsy haul. Now, I am an independent Scentsy consultant. All of these products were purchased by me. I wanted mainly the July warmer of the month. I'm absolutely obsessed with it and then a couple of my friends wanted to place orders for some things so I combined it had one big order and it's here today but I also love sharing Scentsy in the month of July because 90% of the website is actually 10% off this month which is awesome including the warmer of the month that I will show you today called Wild Desert and I will put a link to my party for my new apartment down below, so please feel free to shop and use my link if you want to purchase any Scentsy goodies. So without further ado, let's get into it. First things first, I have a boatload of cleaners. So starting off, well, without, it's not an actual cleaner, but I have a Scentsy Fresh, and if you're unfamiliar with Scentsy Freshes, it's essentially our version of like a Febreze spray, it's a fabric spray, it's all any sorts of like cleaner, or not cleaner spray, but like refreshing. I use these for my cat beds, I use it for my beds, my curtains, any like soft linens, and it just freshens the air, freshens the space. So I got this one in cucumber and cactus water, which is new for the catalog or the summer catalog. I did not order this in a bar, but my friend Natalie, absolutely obsessed with this scent, so I added two bars that are coming to my club next month, so I really am excited to give this one a sniff. Next, I did three bundles. I did a bathroom cleaner bundle, a dish soap bundle, and a counter clean bundle. So, for the bathroom cleaner, me and my friend went in together, and she got two Sunkiss Citrus bathroom cleaners, and I got one in Blue Grotto. She loves the Sunkiss Citrus scent. It's just like a very zesty, bright, orange citrus scent, and I decided to go with Blue Grotto. I love our bathroom cleaners. I like, I love the scents, obviously, but the foam nozzle top just makes it so nice to get the dirt, the grime off of the sink, off of the shower doors. I really, really like our bathroom cleaners. I think they perform really well. They smell really great. And literally you get every drop out of them. So I'm excited to have a new one of those. And then we also went in on a dish soap bundle. She went with two Sunkiss Citrus. See a, see a theme here. And then I went with Squeeze the Day. Squeeze the Day, oh, it's just such a great scent. I'm actually almost out of my dish soap now. So I'm gonna go ahead, maybe, and crack this guy open. Oh, okay. Squeeze the Day is one of the best. It is the best bright lemon scent. I cannot believe that they're doing away with this scent for the sum, fall and winter. I hope it comes back for the spring and summer, but I'm definitely going to add the bars of this to my club. And I have from Simple Human, it's like uh, an electric like hand soap or dish soap dispenser. So I'll pour a bunch of this in there, put my sponge under it, comes out great. I literally probably go under it once, get a teeny bit of soap and it does all the dishes. So really impressed with our dish soap, really like the formula, love the scents, I mean, I haven't had a new one in a long time, so I'm using Autumn Road Trip right now, so definitely not in the season, even though you can see the elephant in the room. I changed my background. It's not 100% to where exactly I want it right now, but I love it and it makes me happy because I love fall. And then last but not least, probably my favorite of all the Scentsy Cleaners is the Scentsy Counter Cleaners. I love the Scentsy Counter Cleaners. This stuff works magic. It cleans hardwood, uh, hardwood surfaces, stainless steel, marble, granite, anything. I love it. it. It just, it cleans my stoves. It cleans my fridge. It actually gets like little stains out of carpets too. It's amazing. And my friend went with two in Sunkiss Citrus. And I went with Make a Splash. Make a Splash is such a delightful scent. I'm actually going to open this right now because I just finished my last counter cleaner uh, literally yesterday. So it's amazing how perfect that was loud. On time, this came in. So 
I love Make a Splash. It's such a great scent in the bar. I haven't had it in the cleaners before, but they also, if you can see, Scentsy's like changed the packaging on their cleaners. So they all have these like really bright, fun images, which I know it's just a cleaner, but it's still fun. It makes cleaning fun. And I also find like one of my really good friends, she buys a lot of these and she says to her kids like, get the mermaid cleaner and Oh yeah, this smells just like Make a Splash. I love it. Make a Splash is like a little slightly sweet um, aquatic scent. Love this scent too. So excited to have this in my life again. But whenever she tells her kids, she goes, get, get some of the mermaid cleaner. And she ends up, you know, cleaning them. Cleaning the counters and helping clean. So, and what's awesome too, all the bundles are also 10% off this month. I don't know all the prices off the top of my head, but you do save some money when you do a bundle normally of three. So make sure you go under my, um, my website and go under specials and you could see the bundle and saves. Those are also 10% off this month. Now these guys, whoop, fragrance flowers. I don't really know if I've shared any of these on my channel, but I'm so excited to have some more fragrance flowers in my new apartment because my entryway of my apartment has a plug. So I have a wallflower in there. Then you go up some steps and then there's a little hallway where like my shoes and there's like a window before like you actually enter my apartment and there's no plug. And I'm like, oh my God, what am I gonna do there? So I'm like, well, maybe I'll just get a reed diffuser because <clears throat> I was like, hoping to put a warmer and a cute table there. I have a cute table a fragrance flower is going to go there. So I'm gonna pop one of these open. I got Blue Grotto, Amazon Rain, and Sea Salt and Avocado. I think we will do Amazon Rain because I love Amazon Rain. Whoops, I just dropped the cap. So I love Amazon Rain. It's just a very like clean, citrusy, watery scent. I really like it. Anyway, so you open your box, you get a little piece of paper here, and then, boom, your fragrance flower is inside, and then your actual flower is inside. So what I do here, and like I said, these are just like reed diffusers, but so much prettier. So you go ahead and take off the plastic, boom, unscrew the cap, and now there is gonna be another plastic cap on top, so make sure you take that guy off. If I can get it off, it'll like normally just pop right off. There we go. Oh yeah, there's that Amazon Rain. Mmm, that's so pretty. Amazon Rain, the citrus in there, really yummy. So then there's a silver cap. Screw that on. Be careful because there's open liquid. And then your actual flower is in this box. Now these flowers are actually handcrafted too out of like a wooden material. So they're super pretty, and then you literally just stick it where the wick is, right in the flower, and boom, you're done. You can set this somewhere, and then the oil's gonna get sucked up through the reed, and it's gonna turn this flower super like wet, and then it's gonna take the scent. Now, one thing about these, they're obviously designed for smaller spaces. So make sure you put it in a smaller space. They're not gonna fill up a bedroom or anything like that. So that's why for my entryway, it's nice. And another thing, airflow. It's super important for airflow to pass it because if it's just sitting stagnant, you're not going to get any scent. Once the oil's there and you're walking by it, the airflow is what's really going to push that scent out and scent your space. So an entryway is perfect because people are coming and going. As weird as it sounds, sticking it maybe on a counter, like on a ledge above like your kitchen sink with the window crack, the window breeze is actually gonna make that scent scent up like your kitchen sink area. So I love these. They last, they suck up every single drop. I know some people take like markers and paint the edges of these to make them look super, super pretty. I will say if something does go wrong with them and if it's colored scents, you won't replace it under the warranty. But they are really pretty because with the wood, when you have like the tips colored, whenever it bleeds out, it actually looks really, really pretty. So I love this. I'm actually going to go get it set up right now. And like the magic of TV, 
Moving on, I did get a six pack of bars, and I know you see five here. One of the bars was on back order, but I wanted to get this video out to you. The bar that's on back order is sugared strawberry. Love sugared strawberry, so that will just ship separately. <laughs> and I just dropped uh, the scent of the month, and this is Desert Tropics. Now, I have my phone. Scentsy says, now I will be honest with you, the scent is definitely not my style, but Desert Tropics says a bright airy array of tropical berries, dragon fruit, lush mango, and pineapple. So, but can you see it's like super sweaty already? So, I mean, it's very hot outside. Yeah, it definitely gives you like a super, super fruity tropical scent. I know that my friend Natalie melted this and she absolutely loves it on warm. So I did add it to my club just in case, but when I melt this, we'll see. It is just like a very fruity tropical scent. The dragon fruit and the mango really are more acidic fragrances. So you do get that like real burst of like citrusy zing with the pineapple. So it's nice. We'll see. I'll melt it and give it a shot. Clementine Cupcake. Now, this is one that was in the catalog. Never ordered it. Didn't really have a... I was like, okay, we'll try it. But I do really, really like it. You really get the cupcake note. Like that yellow, yellow cake. With a hint of citrus. And I like the Clementine. You notice that it's Clementine. And not like super, super orange it's toned down so i did add this to my club i do really like it we'll see bonfire beach such a classic <sighs> people compare this to beach nights but i don't think it smells like beach nights at all this is a very very salty sea air scent with like a hint of toasted marshmallow so pretty i actually have some of these as backups i might switch out my warmer in my bedroom and do some bonfire beach because i really love that scent and then last but not least, Pina Colada Cha-Cha. This, Scentsy does a really good job with pineapple. Now this one I actually got for my friend, but I like the pineapple pucker more because it is like truly super, super juicy pineapple, where this one is more like a true pineapple coconut vibe, but I know she really likes it. And speaking of the warmer and the scent of the month, this is the warmer of the month. It's called Desert Tropics. Now, if you remember, I have all my succulent warmers in my background because I absolutely love and adore the succulent warmers. I think they're so cute. I have the succulent. I have the aloe vera warmer. I have that desert warmer. I love them. And I'm actually going to do a little section in my living room of succulents. I'm waiting on a table to come in from Wayfair. I think it's going to be here the end of the week. So once I get that built and stuff, I'm going to decorate it. And it's just going to be like my year round, like super cute succulent corner. So when they came out with this warmer of the month, I had to have it. Look at this, you guys. It is so cute. So it does all come disassembled. So you do assemble it yourself and this in the back is the element or the it's not an element it's a light bulb it's a 20 watt light bulb there's your little dish and the number four so uh, sensi says the ideal number of cubes to use in this warmer is four i only use about two cubes in a warmer but stick it there and then you have your succulents you have your little glass jars with your beads i love this warmer and I have so many ideas for this in the fall you can fill it with mini pumpkins I already know I'm gonna go to Hobby Lobby fill this with fake snow and put little Christmas tree little minis in here I, I just I'm obsessed with it I love the rose gold metal work I am obsessed with this warmer in every aspect and I think lit with the glow is gonna be so pretty as a nightlight. And this warmer is 10% off this month at $67.50. Again, I'll link my website down below. I love this. This is called the Wild Desert Warmer. I, I think it's so pretty. I'm so happy to add it to my collection. But anyway, that's my haul. Let me know what you guys picked up from Scentsy this month. And if, again, you want to order, I'll leave a link down below. Thank you all so much. I hope you have an incredible rest of your week. And remember, you only have till the end of the month for Scentsy to 
add items to your club. If you don't have a club, let me know. We'll talk. We can set you up with one, or you can do it yourself on Sensi Club. And yeah, you can go ahead and get some orders in at 10% off for the end of the month. As always, make it a better world. Be kind. I love you all so much, and you matter. Bye, guys.